Hold on guys, I farted. Now we're gonna open up some magic packs, take these Pokemon sleeves out of our faces, get some official, or rather unofficial, magic sleeves. Please hang tight. And found them. We got the red colored sleeves right here. Let's make sure that I got plenty. Yeah, I got plenty, what the fuck ever. <coughs> Let's see, we're going to be opening up various different Pokemon products. The uh, single packs that I bought, we'll be opening those up probably in the same video as this one. We have Adventures in the Forgotten Realms. We got Crimson Vow with Olivia Voldarn on the front. And we got typical Japanese night culture. Put that over there. We also have this. The Wanderer Waifu herself. Eee, let's go, baby. Well, she's like raiding with that dang uh, disc on her head or whatever. I don't know. We're opening these up afterward. Starting with the, I mean, starting uh, with actually, no, let's start with Crimson Val after this. And then this after this. And open up the cream of the crop. Come and go with Neon Nine Destiny. Woo, let's go. Okay, sorry, guys. Sorry about that. Hopefully, uh, Charlie won't give a shit. He probably won't, you know. He's basically the Moist King himself. And he's badass for that. Oh, wait, no, this is pull tab. On both sides, what the fuck? Eh. <laughs> oh. That's not a euphemism for a fart, so don't even think about it. Okay. Open this up. We got the Planeswalker. Uh, the Planeswalker's emblem. How the fuck we get this thing out of here? Hold on. Let's just do that. And... Ah, whoa! <coughs> we'll get into this in a moment. Just know there's nothing else inside. Kind of like the depths of my soul. But look at that, bro! That's so Japanese pop art. I love it. And we got, we got like a little... It's like cyberpunk with other Keanu Reeves. Just this hot chick. And this is, I think, art by... Yeah, Hisashi Momose. Hisashi Momose-sai. Sensei, you made a beautiful work of art. This is a delicious banger. I love her outfit. All the beautiful flowers and the just the embroidery. The fact that she has a mostly blank face shows she's an intellectual waifu. She's known as the Wanderer in White. I like that. That is really amazing. I love it. Uh, excuse me while I suck some ramen down because I am literally down bad for my ramen at the moment. So here we go. Excuse me. Oh. Mm. Oh, that's hot. Oh god, ow, that burns. Go put this bad boy up real quick. Oh! Off camera. <clears throat> oh! Oh, that spice hurts. And I freaking love it. <clears throat> oh. Mm. That's was much, much better. Look at that. I like how there's literally this Honden thing in the background. Freaking rad. Whoa, hang on a minute. Hold the bus. What is this about? <clears throat> okay. Oh, cool. Oh, that is badass. What are these, though? Bro, look at that. That's badass. Holy fuck. No clue what these are about, but I guess these are loyalty counters? Ha, yeah, whatever. Whatever they are, they're freaking cool. We have a couple of things here. 
This is the the energy thing. I mean, sorry, a uh, land pack. We'll be going through these first before we go into um, before we go into anything like the regular packs that are in here. Keep those in there. Let's look at the different inserts. Popular magic formats include standard, boost draft, and commander. Standard is pretty cool. I like it. Very limited. You know you can't throw all the best cards throughout Pioneer or even extended or modern into it. Boost to draft is nice. Everyone has a very limited pool of magic cards to work with. Personally, I prefer sealed than draft, but I don't think sealed is even existent anymore. I prefer it's sealed because it's even more limited, but at least you keep all the cards you open. Plus, Booster Draft yields too many rare spammers. And we got the Commander. We know that one. Look up Command Zone here on YouTube. We got the On Your Turn Basic Synopsis. That goes in there. The Attacking and Blocking related shiz here. Boom. In the back, we got the How to Cast Spells. We've seen those before. For those of you who haven't, I've shown these to y'all. I've shown these to y'all. Because it would just be good for you guys to uh, figure out what the fuck you're looking at. And, of course, we got the most amazing pop color spin down. Life D20. Look at that. So freaking cool. It's like candy. <coughs> Oh, not gonna do that again. <laughs> Ooh, that hurt. Anyway, nothing else except the packs. Let's zoom in and zoom back out. The battery is dying. Let's freaking do this. Let's see what energy, I mean, lands we get. Probably not a lot of good. And ass for land. That goes in there. We're gonna go through these and see what we get. I don't know what the fuck this is. This is going into this blind. This is like rice paper. Am I wrong? Or is this like freaking wax or rice paper? A anyway. Check that over there. We got Invoke Despair. That's pretty cool. And we got a bunch of foil land. That's I like this. This is pretty interesting. Okay, that's, that's nice. We're going to put this in the box over here and whatnot. Give me a second, guys, to put things off the side. I'm probably gonna have to charge this camera up before I do anything else. So, um, yeah, we're just gonna open up a couple of these at a time. We're gonna go right to the rares and just ignore everything else. Because everything else is just peripheral shit. We got a human monk. We got amazing art card. We got this. Let's see the rares that we have in here. Would include. Okay, we got Ryu, Storm's Edge, and the Greater Tanuki, the creature enchantment doggo. Moving ever onward. Then those off to the side. We're gonna open this up. <clears throat> this is how we're going to do it, guys. We're just going to blow through them. We got a Winchester Draft. Eh, put that over there. Rude. Put you over there again. Thank you. And beautiful. Bro, I love this. That goes here. Let's see. We got Cloud Steel Keaton. And Kami of Industry. Interesting. So the Kami are still in, but at least I guess they're at peace with humans. Hell, I don't know. Let's keep going as quick as possible. Because, like I said, this camera is low on power. Give me a second. While y'all are at it, before I forget, please like, sub, and share this video. That looks painful as fuck. We got Grease Fang, Okiba Boss, Rat Pilot, Beckoner's Bargain, and oh, dude, we got one card from the list. That card was badass in its day. Bro! 
I'll be sleeping these up afterward and showing a recap in a short video because I clearly don't have a lot of um of time. On hand we got a I'll keep breaking something and let's just go right to the rares. Okay, we got March of Reckless Joy. Network Disruptor. Hmm, interesting. This is going to be one of the quickest magical things I've done in a long time. I think I'll open up the three loose packs over there after this video is over and once this uh, thing is thoroughly charged up. Badass. Oh! Going through, we got Invoke Despair and Light Paws Emperor's Voice. I love the foxes. Foxes are cool. Wolves, they're cool just as much. Yeah. Check that over there. The art card is that dragon. And let's freaking go. Whoa, okay. So we got Tameshi Reality Architect. We got the Moonfolk. We got Patchwork Automaton moving ever so quickly onward before this camera dies. Brr. Check that over there. Gorgeous. Blood fell caves. The Wandering Emperor. Oh, that's beautiful. And we got the 